Crash Your Resolve 18.5 has been out for over a month now, and with it have come many awesome new features, but it doesn't mean it's free of issues. Unfortunately, the initial beta version of DaVinci Resolve 18.5 has been played with a pretty serious issue that I'll be demonstrating today, and I'll also show you how you can fix it. So without any further ado, let's jump into DaVinci Resolve. So we're here in DaVinci Resolve 18.5 now, and I'm using the initial beta release of the software. The issue I've found comes when the speed of an audio clip is changed. Allow me to demonstrate. I'm going to take this sound effect, put it on the timeline, and then change its speed down to 50%. And I'll also turn pitch correction off. If we play the clip back, we hear nothing. This issue affects all audio clips, not just specific ones. This is a pretty huge issue, especially for sound designers who need to modify the speed of sounds in a video to get them to fit properly or to obtain a certain desired creative effect, among other reasons. If we go back into the speed settings for the clip and enable pitch correction, the audio will play back again, but it will not sound very good. So this is a pretty big problem, but like I mentioned before, there is a fix. While DaVinci Resolve 18.5 is still in beta, they are actually still updating the beta to fix bugs and add additional features. Eventually, 18.5 will come out of beta and it shouldn't have any major issues, but for now, in the meantime, the latest build of the beta has a fix. I downloaded it and tested it for myself on my PC just to confirm. So let's take a look at it. I'm using the latest build of DaVinci Resolve 18.5 here on my PC now. If I take this clip and change the speed and play it back, you can hear it properly. This is how it should have been the entire time. But with beta releases, bugs like that are expected. So there you have it. If you want to get the latest build for DaVinci Resolve 18.5 yourself, you can head on over to Blackmagic Design's website and download it from there. I'll leave a direct link to it in the description of this video. Before this video comes to a close, I'd like to announce that I have been working on building an exclusive members-only website behind the scenes for a while now. And I'm excited to announce that it is now launched and available to join. If you're interested in extending your creativity and also supporting my work in this channel along the way, this is a great way to do it. The membership will cost $4.99 on a monthly recurring basis, and with it, you'll gain early access to my DaVinci Resolve tutorials, as well as practice footage, project files, power grades, and lookup tables related to each video. My next DaVinci Resolve tutorial about color grading GoPro footage is available early for members to watch right now. So if that's something that you are interested in, head on over to germanicreative.com slash join extended to sign up today. I'll leave a link in the description of this video for your convenience as well. Aside from that, that's all for this video. I appreciate you watching, especially to the end. If you enjoyed the video, you know what buttons to click. My name is Rocco Germani, Jesus loves you, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.